Howdy y'all, I'm Around the Wheel, you're watching the Neo Wimix Introduction Pack, and this is the final episode, regardless of length, and I'm feeling a little bit of deja vu at the beginning of it, because didn't we play this yesterday? This is uh, The Fiddler 2, with the most cliche subtitle you could possibly come up with, uh, which I will not even dignify with saying out loud. Six lemmings, and this time we have to save five. Last time there were six lemmings and we had to save three, and I don't know, are these steel bits? I don't know. I've slept since then. I don't know. We'll see. Let's find out. Same scenario, but a different trick. If you assign your blocker to cancel the basher for your staircase, another lemming facing the other way, who turned at the end of the basher tunnel before, can dig out the blocker and then bash away from the staircase to stop it from digging a pit. Instead of a lemming facing the other way, you could also use the blocker to turn around a lemming who is very close to him who proceeds to dig and bash. But enough talk and let's see this in practice. Okay, wait. So let me let me go over that again because uh, sometimes I cause sometimes these are a lot of text and I have trouble parsing them out. If you assign the blocker to cancel the bash for your staircase, another lemming facing the other way. So, that is to say left, who turned at the end of the basher tunnel before, can dig out the blocker. You could also use the blocker to turn around a lemming who is very close to him. Okay, alright. I think that's semi-redundant. It's kind of weird, but let's give it a try. Okay, so we're going now. We're going to do the blocker bit again. So, alright. I think I, I think I understand what is being asked of me here, but I'm going to go ahead and, okay. Okay, so you block. That's pretty close. Okay, so, but, okay, yeah, but he, he turns around then. Okay, so yeah, I said, okay, okay, so this is why we have the steel bit here. It's to go ahead and dig him out. And then he goes ahead and bashes when he's low enough to make a full tunnel. But he also has to, like... His friends also have to be able to get up away from... Oh, yeah, that's right. We can't, uh, can't do it too late. Okay, so will they walk up that? No, they won't. They, they won't walk up that. That's a... And that's a problem. So, uh... Uh, yowie zowie. Okay, so... So, how do we... Okay, did I get too close? Did I get too close for comfort? Can they walk up through... Huh. Okay, so yeah, he he digs, and he turns around, but then this blocker is the only one that can die. So, he needs to, like... Okay... I'm going to go ahead and put one right here. I think they can walk up through that, but I could be wrong. So I'm going to go ahead and... Okay, before he turns around, I'm going to have him dig. Okay, and then he... Okay, that's two... Okay, he gets... Okay, and that wasn't even close enough anyway. Okay, yeah, so this is this is uh, true to... True to the title, this is a little fiddlier than the last one. Oh, and the release rate's higher, I noticed. Thanks a lot for that. Okay, so... Alright, so he goes... Uh, is that close enough for the... No, I think that's as close as we did it last time. So, I'm gonna go ahead and... Yeah. I think that's gonna... That might actually be too close... To where they don't even walk up it when he's done. Okay, so you go... Yeah, yeah, okay. Alright. He needs to go all the way through, though. So... But he's... Do... When he... Okay, yeah, they can get up that. But they're gonna just walk through... I see a diagonal pixel there. Yeah, it's not gonna... It's not gonna pan out. So if he hits here, is he gonna turn around? Or is he just gonna... Okay, yeah, he'll turn around. Okay, but I need to maybe come from a little... I did this wrong from the very get-go. So, okay, there we go. Alright, so... We want to get maybe as close to the wall as we can. I don't know if I was 
fully close. I might have been, but not not really entirely sure. Okay, yeah, same thing happened there. So I actually need to get a little, not totally, it, no, come on now, not totally close to the wall. I need to get like a few pixels back, maybe at least, and then, uh huh. Okay, and then we're still too close to the wall to get up for. Mm. This is ugly. Okay, yeah, this is very... This is this is not fiddly because the digger freeing the blocker is hard to do. This is fiddly because you actually have to bash from, like, kind of a weird spot back. Uh, unless I'm just going too far with this. Okay. Okay, and let's see if they can get up through that. Block. Dig. Okay, and then he goes up through there. Okay, yeah, that's a lot safer. And then they get up into there. So now he goes, and he turns around when he finishes bashing through that. And that should get them all up through there. Okay, yeah. Ooh, boy. That was, that was very, very fiddly. True to form. So, now, now it might be a bit easier here. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and get you going. Yeah, this is gonna, this is still gonna be pretty, okay, yeah, so, alright, so you're gonna go ahead and dig there, I don't even think, yeah, you could, I don't even think he was able to get close enough to, okay, maybe this is where, maybe this is where you have to do it, like, facing the same direction, okay, uh-huh, yeah, that frees him, but then he keeps going. So is this the is this the same directional one? Maybe it is. Although no, we can go farther with this if we wanted. There's no reason we can't go a little farther here. Yeah, we can just we can just take this one. Yeah, let him go there. And then blah. No, but that doesn't that doesn't get close enough to free him, though, really. So yeah, this is the is the, this is the same directional one. Uh, a little tougher to understand. Uh, okay, so you go here. You start digging. So yeah, no matter what, he makes a full tunnel to the end, and we don't want that. So how do we? How do we? fix that up okay let's go back okay yeah I think this is the part where we do it going in the same direction all right yeah Okay, I think I understand what it's asking for here. We might want to get it to go... No, that doesn't really... What if we make him the blocker? Okay, so you can get like slightly underneath him at that point, but it's not... Oh yeah, and that's not even... That's not even close to what we want. Maybe... Yeah, maybe you have to get like slightly farther away from him and free him that way. No matter what you do, you get a full blocker. Huh. I think we... Do we want to do this in a place and in a way so that it doesn't provide you a full basher tunnel? Hmm. How would we do that, though? We really are running up on time here. and This should not be this hard for me to be figuring out. Uh, okay, so, and then, same direction, wait, oh, no, 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 got it that time, it was just really finicky again, and we can just, we can just let you go there, okay, alright, wow, I thought I was about to have to look that up, that was, that was a very, oh, no, 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 yeah, 
We don't want it to get... Ha, ah, crap. Okay, well, no, 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 no. Yeah, just let it go. Alright, yeah, and then this time bash so that he just runs into this thing. There we go. Turns him around. Very good. Okay, so five and four. I think we saved everybody we needed to. Right, right. I'm not going to be... Sh no, no, I'm not going to be short any wings. We're good. We're good. Okay, wow. Okay, that took... Feel like a lot longer than it should have to uh, get that done, but that is uh, that is certainly a hard thing to do. Is there going to be a third way we do that exact same thing? What's gonna What's gonna wait? Is Revenge of the Fiddler? Sure enough, there is a third way to do this somehow. Three lemmings got to save uh, two of them, all but one. All right, so what is the third and final way to... Same scenario, same trick, but now lemmings are close together and only one can turn around. So, like, release rate of 99 or something. You can still pull this trick off by assigning a basher to a second lemming that will then bash right behind your main one. This way you're not depending on another lemming coming by at the right time and he won't turn around. After the trick, the second basher still needs to turn around, but I've placed some steel blocks... To help you out here, fiddle away. Okay, so you can pull this trick off by assigning a basher to a second lemming that will then bash right behind your main one. So, all right, so at least one of these guys is going to be, okay, so, all right. And we have one blocker still helping out with this. So, all right. All right, so one of them goes on, and I think this one is going to be a swimmer, just so I can kind of get these two to do a thing. All right, so what happens then? Okay, so do... All right, and then he digs and bashes. Is that what I'm... Wow, how is that so much easier to figure out than the other one? Okay, so same deal here, and then we can kind of get it done the other way. All right. So they're going to end up pretty close to each other, I surmise. Maybe. Okay, so... All right. One of them is going to... One of them is going to bash through the way here. And then, yeah, from here it's kind of the... Kind of the same simple trick. Okay, so... We're going to let him... We're going to let him go around the way here. Okay, that might be too uncomfortable, but yeah, yeah, okay, all right, so he yerks up into the, okay, yeah, they might need to be a lot closer to each other then, actually, uh, okay, so yeah, you're gonna have to get up in there, so he's up in there before he like, okay, all right, so if he goes, so now he can go from here. They can both bash together. Okay, all right. So I think I see what I'm what I'm supposed to be accomplishing here. Okay, you. All right, so yeah, and then get him going, and then yeah. Oh golly, part three was the super fiddliest of them all, but somehow I solved that one a lot faster, huh? Maybe when you just start fiddling around with things, you start seeing it a little better. Who knows? But are we going to be doing all the fiddling in this final level? Is that what's going to be asked of us? This is where, this is where, okay, this is where we finally go up against the devil and we go down to Georgia and we bet a fiddle of gold against the soul. I think I'm a better limbing fiddler than you. Okay, victory lap. Advanced training 21. I think that's the final level, right? Uh, there might actually be another one after this. I may have miscalculated the number of levels again. No, this is the final level. Okay, victory lap it is. Last level, and are we going to be fiddling around, or what's up? 15 lemmings, gotta save 11. Are we going to use, like, literally everything we've somehow learned here? This one might get crazy. Remember the last levels and the things you learned about diggers. Okay, so we're pulling back all the digger knowledge, too. And I bet you'll be able to solve this riddle. So we're going to do some digging. We're going to do some fiddling. 
We're going to be hunting for treasure. Okay, so. All right, we got four livings going through here. Okay, so those four livings are going to be the ones that die, presumably. Okay, we've got this happening. All right, so. All right, you're going to go. This one is going to turn around real quick. Okay, I think I could see that much happening here. Okay, yeah, there's steel in here. Alright. We got steel a happenings. No, wait, this part right here is steel. Okay, so they're gonna wanna climb up that, I guess. They're gonna wanna climb up and get to a point where we can. Alright, this is really. Alright, this is really bizarre. Okay. But we've got a blocker. We're not going to need that blocker until we get up in the... In the thing. But we got to get all the way around to here. And that is the final goal. But I think we want this first one to turn around at least. I, I am kind of intuiting that right up at the front. Okay. Alright, so we got to get a miner now going. Uh, we got to get to that miner. Okay, you're gonna go... Do we want him to... Alright, you're gonna go from here. Alright, and this is gonna keep everybody safe for the time being. Okay, so what we want... Is to come in here... Do we want to go all the way up the way here? What? Whoa, no, 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 no. We don't want Lemmings dying on us. Two... Okay. Oh, wow. That got... That got finicky. Um... Hmm. So, then we bash through here, it would seem. Alright, so we're gonna bash through here, I think. And kind of get out... Are we gonna go all the way around? We have to get up into here somehow. And that's going to require... Oh, God. This is an ugly level. It's always the ones with all the pickup skills. That that makes it hard to parse. Like, So we're going to have another Miner and Basher. Okay, so let's, let's say we get through to here. And... Alright, yeah. So... Alright, let's go ahead and bash through here for the time being. Oh god. Okay, everybody lived through there. So I think that's what was supposed to be done here. Okay, so now... Okay. Okay, so if we go through here... That is... Not quite correct. We've got a miner, though. And we can get up into here. So we go... We go here with this. Huh. We kill another lemming. Like, bomb here. To make it so that they can walk up through that. Is that what I'm... Is that what I'm seeing here? So... You get just a little bit away from him and it releases him so he can... No, that's that wouldn't have been close enough anyway. Okay. Maybe back off in one step there. Okay, yeah, that gets them in there. But they have to be able to climb up that wall somehow. So I think I need to back it up. They're safe there. So what happens is... So what I want to do is like go like right here. So that when I bash through to here... Okay, I think this is where I want to create my go through the way here type of thing. Okay, so he goes blomp, blomp, yes. Okay, yeah, so they can all walk up through there and still make it just fine. And then we have, then we have minor platformer to solve it for the rest of them when they come up the way. Okay, okay, okay. I'm getting this, I'm getting this. I will get there, I think eventually. So we go up through here now. He comes up the wall. All right, and this is going to make it so that we have two to do this next part. All right, so you go here. 
Bop, free him. Okay, so yeah. We have pickup skills going now. Are these traps? No, they, they're they not even moving, I don't think. What am I thinking? Okay. So now we have another... Do we have any other climbers? We have two bombers. Okay, two more climbers to assist with this part. Okay. Alright, so I think what we're going to do to get everybody up the way here... Is I think we're going to... Do I want to handle this part next? I'm thinking I do. Because we're going to get two more climbers to help out with this. So I think what we're going to want to do then... We're, we're going to bomb up here. One guy is going to bomb up here. But am I going to do another... I don't think I'm going to do another... Get everybody up through the little funky thing thing. I think this time all I want to do is get this here. There we go. And so he bashes through here. Alright, I think he might be... I think he might be making the rest of the way for the other lemmings. So, boink, boink. Okay, and then you get everybody through there. Alright. One platformer. Huh. There's no shimming of any kind, and this is all trap. All trap, all steel, no getting through this. So I think we're going to be platforming over this little bit right here. I think we're going to go ahead and do that to get him turned around. Okay. So now what we're going to do... Okay, yeah, that gets him going there. I feel like we need two more lemmings to come up the way here. How do we want to... How do we want to handle this? I feel like we need to come down through here. Huh. So two miners. We dig... Maybe we dig and mine here. Alright, what do we have left? We have... Actually, we have two diggers, yeah. So... We come through here... He turns around right there. What is two more... What is two more lemmings? Okay, so we have to mine here, obviously. One of the miners has to be here so that they can walk up into here. So we gotta do that. We have to do that bit. I just wonder if we can handle all this separately. And let two lemmings handle it at the end. Because if I dig through here. That's going to make. Hmm. If I dig through here, that's going to make a, a splatter height. Yeah. Uh, ooh, just barely. And we have no more skills left to help to help with that. Okay, so what we want to do, I th think... <laughs> I'm going to try to jank this out real quick. I just want to see what happens if I try to jank it. Okay, so if I go from here, that eliminates their ability to get up to here. So, he needs... So, the other lemmings need to come through. One of them needs to turn around, I think. So that they can all get up here. The other miner needs to be right here. Because they all need to get up... Well, hold on. Other digger... I have one digger right now. Well, what good does digging do, really? Because if I dig right here, then they're not able to get up when they come over the way here. They need to get up. I mean, I can't very well mine upward. I don't have a fencer. So, 
what am I doing then? You gotta get him up here this way. You gotta do that. You gotta get him through with the miners. But the only... Well, okay, okay. We can avoid cutting through that, actually. But then there's no way to... There's no way to do that from... Oh, boy. Okay, so... One bomber. Okay, so two diggers. One bomber. I'm having trouble figuring out where the rest of the stuff goes. Alright. Yeah, uh-huh. Go there. Hmm. There's no real way to do this with a... With a digger here because everybody kind of has to follow him into the digger hole, right? Huh. What am I doing wrong here? I am missing something big, but what is it? Alright, here's what we're gonna do. What I was not picking up on was ways to get these lemmings up here combinations of mining and bombing okay so what's gonna happen here is we're gonna go from about right here and we're gonna get our climbers headed back this way and one of them is going to turn around and start mining this is very tight space we're talking about here this is actually we may have even wanted to go a little farther with the basher so let's go ahead and let him go on and ahead I think, I think we can maybe go a little farther than we just decided to here. Okay. Alright, we're going to try this then. I don't know how exact it's demanding, but I think it's going to be pretty tight. We're going to want to go from like here. Yeah. So mine down from here to make a staircase up the way. Then we're going to want to bomb this guy. He's going to get right about here. Okay, yeah. And this is the kind of... Okay, wait, we want this kind of eagle build lip here. Okay. So, what that's going to accomplish then... Alright. That's going to get us going down the way more. Okay. Okay, and I think what we want to do then is maybe... I think I can go ahead and mine the... Or bomb this guy right here. Okay. Bop. Okay, and then they're all going to walk up into here. Okay. So then what we... No, 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 no. You don't want to kill that one yet. Okay, no. Um, I'm a little jumping the gun there. So we need that climber. Because we need somebody else to pick up these climbers. Okay. I was kind of jumping the gun a little. But you do need a bomb right there. I was trying to combine things that shan't not be combined. So, okay. Beep, beep. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Alright, so you go here and get these. What we're gonna do then is... Okay. Alright, so... We're gonna get... Okay, we're gonna get a climber to go up. All right. All right. And then you're going to bomb there and let them get up the, the thing there. That may be too steep, actually. Okay, yeah, that's actually too steep. So he needs to walk a little farther than that even. Okay, so... No, no, no. Too... Too early. Um... Needs to be in just the right spot so they can think that ought to be good okay as long as they can get up nope they can't get up over that lip oh my god oh god Ugh. yeah fiddly is the word here okay so all right he picked that up so now can they get up that one no that's too far away or that's too that's too okay always too something Okay, this one is no good, and this one is no good. So, my mining was somehow incorrect. Unless I can, uh, 
afford to go even farther up the hill, which I can't. Okay. Oh, this might be good, actually, right here. Let's try that. That looks pretty good to me. That leaves one pixel they can lip up over. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so, all right. Now, what we want to do, okay. All right, I think what we want to do now is get another climber going. Yeah, we need to get another climber going now. It's got to be kind of spaced a little. Okay, they're all going to go up in the thing. It's got to be spaced in such a way that the climber follows him up into here. And then you do the two digger trick where it turns, you know... You dig inside the hole, it turns the old one around, he falls through, and it's going to make like a little step. So it's going to, at the same time that you're solving the problem of turning somebody around to free them, you're also solving the problem of eliminating the splat height. So, alright, so we're going to wait till about... I'm going to wait till like right... I'm going to give the... Oh my god. I cannot click to save my life. Okay, so there we go. Okay. We're going to take this from about here. Actually, that's not comfortable enough for me, turns out. Uh, we're going to take the one after that even. Okay. About the space from the wall to the wall. Okay. And even that may not be... Even that may be a little too much for me. No, he's climbing. He's climbing. That's giving him a good bit of slowdown. Okay. Okay. So, yeah, here we go. Okay. And then we come here. Alright. And then once he falls in, he starts digging in a way that... Okay. Yeah, we want to leave a step for the lemmings to get by on. So he starts to climb. Yeah, and see, then he hits the little nook, turns around, and he's able to save the rest. And that's how we do... The victory lap, uh, a level I did not particularly enjoy trying to sort out. Uh, that was very, very kind of yikes. Uh, let's go ahead and get this to the end, though. See, now they have this little step to go on right here. And they all make it to the exit safely. Good job. Let's let the climber go in, and then it's time to do some talking. Okay. So, there we are. We're through the Neo Limix introduction pack. Final thoughts. Not as fun as I thought it was going to be, honestly. Um, I feel like if this is the kind of thing you need to, and I'm using air quotes here, introduce people to, I think you're going to scare a lot of people off with this kind of thing. Uh... All except the the very most hardcore, the lifers. Um, I like to think I'm okay at video games, but a lot of this I still feel shaky about, even having done it. And I know Eco has said it's the kind of thing where it's like, you know you run into these things very, 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 very rarely in the course of actual lemmings, custom lemmings solving. But it's just that they're things that you need to know because they may pop up, because people may decide to use these things. And by people, I think he's saying Eco is going to decide to use these kinds of things. Like if you ever play a pack... He's made, which is frankly something I think I might avoid doing. Um, it is a little beyond what I'm thinking Lemmings ought to be. The vision of Lemmings that I have in my head. I am not really certain how much of the nitty gritty of Neo Lemmings is for me personally. Sometimes it's impressive. Sometimes it's really cool. Sometimes it's like, wow, 
really pushing this thing to the limits of what it can do. And other times... Other times it's just like, what? Is, what there, there's a sort of sensory overload going on where, where it's like, I don't even know where to start, what to do with this. And because I'm overloaded, I end up forgetting things that might have might have appeared to my brain otherwise. I don't know. Things were pretty cool up to a point. Uh, advanced training is where I really started going like, is this the thing for me? And I'm not entirely certain it is. I think there's a certain threshold of lemmings where when I get beyond that point, I'm going to be out of my depth, not looking very smart, not having a lot of fun. So, I'm glad I had this kind of sandbox to get used to it before I jumped into something way beyond my depth. Something like, for example, Lemmings United, where I would have just been like, this would have taken two years to record. Uh, as it is, I think I need to step away from Lemmings for a while. Um... I think I'm I think I'm burning out on lemmings and I think if I'm going to continue doing this I need to do other things. Um cracking magic packs is giving me something to do. Uh on the days when I can't record and that has proven fun for me. Uh for people who like magic and even for people who don't like magic they've said they're enjoying it even though they don't play it. But yeah, so we've been introduced to Neil Limix. There we are. There we have it. That is the grand finale of the pack. And so I think it is time to move on. I think it's time to move on to some different kinds of things for a while. So I think I know what I want to do next. Uh, <laughs> it's uh, it's kind of funky. Um just to hint at it, I'll say that it's a Super Mario World ROM hack that is dangerously cheesy. Having left you with that, uh, let's, uh, let's try the next, not Lemmings level, but the next game. I'll see you guys next time in a decidedly non-Lemmings kind of setting.